What's good, everybody? It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject here, and welcome back to our Vanderbilt Rebuild Dynasty here on NCAA Football 14, man. One and one on the season here in week three. Um, you know, we took a loss to Ole Miss the first game of the season. Then we bumped off UAB. Now here we are back in SEC action, taking on the South Carolina Gamecocks, who are currently 0-2. Now, Kirk's still rolling with them. Uh, they're slightly better on paper. They're a B, B minus B, where B minus B, B minus. We have them beat in every statistical category except for rush defense because, you know, we give up 280 yards a game. It's kind of horrible. But also, you know, having somebody beat in turnover differential here on this game is not a good thing because we're negative six and they're plus one. Now, you come over here looking at our team leaders currently. Riley Neal is the quarterback. He has three seven, He has three touchdowns to seven picks. All three of his touchdowns have gone to Kalaja Lipscomb. And then Keyshawn Vaughn, 48 uh, carries, 242 yards, five yards a carry, five touchdowns. Defensively, George is leading us in tackles with 12. Anderson's leading us in picks with one. And uh, Adi Ingbu uh, is leading us in sacks with two. Looking at the South Carolina leaders, ben Jack Bentley, I believe his name is Jack, if I remember correctly, He's got two touchdowns and no picks. Their running back averages five yards a carry, and then uh, they have one receiver, but they don't have – he doesn't. he's their leading receiver, but he doesn't have a, a receiving touchdown. And their two losses were to UNC in Georgia. You know, it doesn't look like their offense does that well. So, you know, hopefully we can come out here and get some stops. I'm not going to show you guys recruiting yet because there's no major changes right now. We are taking the lead on some guys, but we have yet to offer anybody, you know – any scholarships or anything like that. So maybe next episode we'll touch on recruiting before we get into the game. But as far as this episode, let's get into it. Now, players we have to watch out for here on South Carolina, they have an 87 overall middle linebacker, 87 overall wide receiver, and then huh, one of their top three players are their punter. So I'm not too worried. Let's get out here and get this W. All right, guys, here we are. South Carolina, williams Bryce Stadium. So here we are. You know, we got to get the rock first. Bowler back here to return a kick. He hasn't had really a great return yet this year. This might be the start of one. Ah. You see here, Keyshawn Vaughn is our impact player. Last game, 26 carries, 95 yards, and two TDs. There's no secret on our offense, you know, who we're trying to get the ball to out. I mean, who we're trying to get the ball to here. Like I said, it's Keyshawn Vaughn, Kalaja Lipscomb. Those are the guys. Starting it off getting the ball to Vaughn. He's got some lead blockers. He's not the fastest, though, but, you know, he's going to give you a tough five, you know, four or five yards every run. Our game plan here today, keep the ball on the ground early and often. Then with that, open up the pass game for Neil. That seems to, you know, work best for us. Easy handoff to, uh, to Vaughn here as he picks up the first. Boom. Good read. Neil has some running room, and we're going to get down. Let's go. We pick up another first. All right, guys, we're on the road. We're across the 50. You know what I mean? We got nothing to lose out here. Two bottom dwellers of the, of the conference right now. Good read. Neil has some space and some blocks. Let's go, baby. Ride the sideline. Let's go. 27-yard pickup by Riley Neal. All right, here we go. Another first and 10. More people in the box. They're, uh, they're pressing Mosley. He beats his man, and we hit him in the end zone, and we strike first, baby. What a drive. All right, boys, here we go. Coming out in our defense, they're spreading us out. Remember, we cannot switch uh, defenders here. And so far, we are not that great at stopping the run. The quarterback keeps it. And Bentley picks up a first down much more. And if they score in one play, dog, I swear. George, our leading tackler, is the last line of defense. And he breaks that tackle. And we finally bring him down after 73 yards. Our coach calls a lot of these uh, dime nickel uh, you know, packages. And it doesn't work out for us that great. We leave ourselves wide open sometimes, so hopefully he starts bringing us more in like the 3-4 and the 4-3 and stuff like that. And the receivers beat over the middle, and just like that in three plays, South Carolina answers back. One thing we have to not get caught up in is trying to, you know, score as quickly as they did. A few moments later. Shelton Mosey beats his man off the line again, and it looks like we might just indeed answer back just as quickly. This one could possibly be a shootout, and Shelton Mosey has his second TD of the game. All right, now, defense, I need you guys to step it up big time here. What we did last drive just wasn't it, Chief. Here we go. 
It's a draw play. Make the tackle. There we go, fellas. Ah, I read that somewhat, but our right, third and fourth for South Carolina here. Man in motion. Watch out for the screens. But they go underneath. And they still pick up the first. Almost every computer team on Heisman, man. They run the no huddle every single time. It's all good, though. Oh, off his back foot to Edwards. And they pick up the first down. Back of the end zone wide open. And just like that, they strike back again. All right, Riley Neal's having a good game here today. Four for five, 103 yards, and two touchdowns. See if he can pick up this first down with his arm here. Little check down there to Vaughn. He's got to try to make some people miss. He does, and he gets the first down. Juking one person, breaking another tackle. Let's go. Keyshawn does have, you know, home run abilities. You know, the home run hitting ability. But for the most part, he's a grinding back, bruiser. You know, going to wear you down, make you tired of touching him, of hitting him. As they're showing off the home run ability, stiff arming, falling four, and he's down inside the 10. And just like that, we're over 100 yards rushing as a squad today. All right, so it's third and goal. We're one for two on third downs here today. They're aggressive. We go with the screen. Vaughn has some blocks, and he's in the end zone, baby. Let's go. If our defense could just step it up to the level that our offense is playing at, we would be great. First and goal. Ah, it's a, it's a, a screen. We weren't ready for it. It's a run. It's a counter. Ah, oh, you got to make that tackle, fellas. Come on. Come on, Anderson. Trip him up. Woo! Touchdown saving tackle right there. Pick, pick, pick. Come on. Oh, he knocked it loose. Thank you, man. Because, you know, that's one of those things. That's hey, I could have clicked on him and made that play, but I have to trust my guys. Facing another third down. This time a third and long. Looking to pick it up here. Oh, no. I thought... I thought Kalaja Lipscomb was running a fly, and as soon as I set my feet to throw it, he started cutting in. That's just a miscommunication right there, man. Threw it right to the DB. We need a turnover, boys. Big time. Quarterback keeps it. Oh, my goodness. Bentley out here trucking people. Finally, we bring him down. It's a run. George is there. He makes the tackle. Let's get it. Oh, I tried to bait him up. It didn't work pick-wise, but we make the immediate tackle, and they're going to have to settle for three. Minute 40 left, looking to pick up this first down. I want to keep it on the ground, but let's, let's try a little play action here and see what we can get out of it. So Mosey's been eating on that side of the field here today. Got a receiver open. It's Pinkney. He picks up the first down, breaks the tackle, trucks another, and gets out of bounds. Tough throw over the middle. Pinkney makes the tough catch. Let's go. Got to love having a shorthand tight end like that. Come out in the read option. See what they give us. Matter of fact, we'll go with the play action here. Bring Limpscomb on the cross. Going to Pinckney again. He's been our, one of our top receivers here today. Riley Neal's truly in the groove. We're one for one in the red zone with a touchdown. There we go. Switching things up. See what Bowler can do one-on-one. -on -one, if it is a true one-on-one. -on -one. Nope. Going to go to Pinckney again. Get in the end zone, big man. Let's go. Get off me. So we're going head into the locker room with an eight-point lead. South Carolina gets the rock to start up the second half. If our defense can keep up this intensity and our offense continues to, you know, control the clock and dominate the ball, we should be able to get this W. Second and four here, fellas. Show a little blitz. Nobody's really open. Get there and hit the quarterback. I didn't mean to switch off there. <laughs> Nobody was open for Bentley on that play. So he, he, he opted to throw it away. We're going to leave Dimitri Moore in a spot here. Just in case he decides to take off. So screen. And we take it away, baby. And get the sack. Let's go. So our defense holds them to three once again. Now it's time for the offense to come out here and respond. First and ten. We are at. What's this? The 25. Hand off to Vaughn. Woo! Look at this spin, baby. Little false start. Throw a little salt in our game there. It's all good, though. First and 15. Want them to overcommit? They do. Look at the screen wide open. Throw wheels, Vaughn. Get in the end zone, baby. Bang! Let's go. And just like that, Riley Neal goes ahead and looks like he ties the school record for passing touchdowns on the game with five. You know? 
Hey, man, let's get it. Adi Yangbu is going to be the spy here. Let's play the pass. Ooh, pressure getting to him, and we forcing a punt. First punt of the game for South Carolina. All right, boys, so our defense plays with a comfortable lead for the first time, and they do wonderfully. Now it's time to try to take the top off the defense here. Oh, Lipscomb has his step. He catches it in stride. He's not that fast. He breaks the tackle. He's going to get into the end zone. Let's get it, baby. All right, fellas, so the squad is coming alive here today. You see Riley Neal just broke the school record for touchdowns in the game. Let's go. Get there, Herbert. Hibbert, and we get the pick, baby. Stop trying to run them screens on us, dog. Let's go, fam. Six for eight on third down conversions here today. Looking to pick up yet another. Third and 15. Oh, wow, I did not see Brunson there. And even with all the touchdowns here today, Riley Neal cannot stop turning the ball over his second pick today. All right, so that pick blows, especially after we just caught one, we throw one right back. But you know what happens. Oh, read option on their own for South Carolina, and Bentley gets another big run. He breaks another tackle and another tackle, and 94 is the last line of defense, and he's finally brought down inside the 20 he has a 73 yard run today and a 63 yard run today and now he's over 150 yards on the defense the lead is big man but it's not you know impossible for these guys to come back so we definitely need to tighten up a little bit here definitely thought we we're gonna put it away they go with the oh i over commit over pursue and we come back and we push them forward another seven yards south carolina not going away quietly by any means First and goal for them. Quarterback keeps it. Cop it's there. If they didn't let me make that tackle, I was going to break my control. We're committing to the run again. I want to see them beat us with their arm. It's another run, and we're all over it. He breaks some tackles, but it doesn't matter. We're still coming. Here we go, guys. Third and goal. They have to put six. I mean, they have to, get it. They have to score. You know what I mean? They go to another screen. We overcommit. We overpursue with more, and Wow! Come on, yo. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is. Get those fours up. We got a 12-point lead, but we're driving. You know, we're trying to completely take over the game here and make it impossible for South Carolina to come back. So with that last run, Keyshawn Vaughn goes over 100 yards. Here we are starting off the fourth quarter. We're in yet like another shootout. Get the edge. Ugh. Third and 16. This is where we threw the pick in the red zone off of. Shelton Mosley eating off the line. Holds on to the, to the ball. We're going for it. Come on. Let's keep our foot in their throats. Three catches, 107 yards for Justice Shelton Mosley. Fourth and three here. We're going to go with the read option. I think it's our best bet, honestly. Boom. Riley Neal. Tough yard. Slide. Let's go. All right. Second and two here. More of the same. Vaughn getting the first down, getting the tough yards. Another eight. All right. So with that throwaway, we stop the clock. Third and seven here. I'm going to try to keep it on the ground. They spread, they spread everybody out. Come on, Vaughn. There we go. Give me those tough yards, baby. Let's eat, man. There we go. Third and six. Oh, I see you, Pickney. Turn. Breaking more tackles. And he's getting back in the end zone. They can't even tackle this man out here today. Woo. So we, we're forced to punt here while we're trying to run out the clock. And we get a, a coffin corner here on the one-yard line. Now we're looking to get this safety to get our 50 burger, man. Oh, they actually go to pass. They go deep. And oh, he dropped it and won a pick. Let's go. The computer lays out and makes a pick. Our impact player Watkins gets us the ball back. Cam Watkins. Let's go, baby. Look at this. Bounce off his hands. He lays out and makes the one hand grab, man. Let's go. Oh, Pickney beating this man, and we are adding insult to injury, and we score once again. Hey, man, y'all know me by now. I don't have any sympathy. There's not a humble bone in my body when it comes to this. And that's going to do it, guys. The clock hits triple zeros. You see our main man, Keyshawn Vaughn, today. 216 yards, two touchdowns. 
you know, of offensive of offense. Offensive production, I said it right. Riley Neal was the player of the game, threw eight touchdown passes out here today, setting a new school record, getting it done. South Carolina goes down to 0-3. We improved to 2-1. All right, guys, so real quick, taking a look at the scoring summary. You know, it was close throughout for the most part, but we shut South Carolina out in the fourth quarter. You know, um, we scored 14 every quarter except for the fourth because we went for two on a – one of our drives trying to get 50, and we got 50 anyway. All right, so player stats on the day. Riley Neal, 18 for 29, 358, eight touchdowns and two picks. 62 completion percentage, 20 yards per average uh, on his completion. 72 was his longest of the day. Only sacked one time. Keyshawn Vaughn on the ground, 24 carries, 145 yards, but unable to find the end zone. Riley Neal, 11 for 66. Both of those guys averaged six yards a carry. Receiving, Keyshawn Vaughn led us in receiving with seven, with seven catches, 71 yards, two touchdowns. Our tight end, Pinkney, seven catches, 114 yards, and three TDs. Shelton Mosey, three catches, 107 yards, two touchdowns. And Limp, our boy Kalaja Limpscomb made the most of his one catch for 66 yards, and he got a touchdown out of that. Defensively, Frank Coppett led us in tackles with five all solo, followed by Dimitri Moore and Allen George with four all solo. Uh, we had two sacks, one to Eddie Zinn Turner, one to uh, Dale Andebengu, and then we had two picks, Kenny Hibbert, and Cam Watkins, and we got a big time W out here, man. These guys played great, very dominant. You know, it was shaky in the beginning. Our defense definitely needs to improve, but with time, that will happen. But the offense really clicked, and it was against the SEC opponent, so it was a much needed W. So hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode, man. If you did, stop and smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, ArcadeGames.com. I'm out of here. Peace. <laughs>